What's up, everyone? Chris from PickDogs.com here with your free pick in the my, uh, Colorado Rockies versus Los Angeles Dodgers Major League Baseball matchup going down Wednesday, June 28th, 2023. Just a reminder, if you haven't already, make sure you're subscribed to our channel. Smash that thumbs up. It helps us out a ton. And if you're looking for my best bets, the games I love the most, including my daily $19 best bet, head on over to PickDogs.com and click the Premium Picks tab at the top of the page. But let's get to this one between the Colorado Rockies and the Los Angeles Dodgers. The Colorado Rockies sending out Kyle Freeland to the mound in this one. No starter confirmed for the Dodgers as of late. Now, the last time, or excuse me, as of yet, the last couple times that we have seen Clayton Kershaw go for the uh, the Dodgers. Once it was started by Michael Grove, and then the last time out it was a bit, it was a a bullpen game. Now I'm not seeing Michael Grove listed on any injury report. So it could potentially be Michael Grove. I'm not 100% sure. If not, I would, I would suspect some sort of bullpen game or, uh, you know, opener followed by a long relief arm. Something to that nature for the Los Angeles Dodgers. But um, what we do know, though, like I said, is that Kyle Freeland is going to get the nod for the, for the Rockies here. And don't get me wrong. Kyle Freeland has really not been a pitcher that I've sort of gone out of my way to back over the course of you know, the season. I mean, this year he is 4-8, and eight, a 4.54 ERA. But historically, Freeland has been a guy that's been one of the few pitchers that's actually pitched better at Coors Field. He is a Colorado kid, so he knows, you know, the altitude very well. You know, he's used to this environment. And not only that, he's had some success against the Los Angeles Dodgers. He actually won two of his three home starts against the Dodgers last year. Gave up three runs in six innings on two separate occasions on May 28th and and, uh, July 30th. Gave up six uh, hits in each of those starts as well, but managed to get the win in both of those spots. And I think he's got a decent shot here to at least keep the Dodgers in this game. You know, I just, I don't love this Dodgers bullpen if that's what ends up being the situation here. Hopefully we'll be able to update that for you on uh, on Wednesday's morning show. But even then, the Dodgers in the last two weeks have a bullpen ERA of 4.24. And while the Colorado Rockies down at 6.23 and 27th, Freeland's been able to to hold some teams down, and the, it's not like the Los Angeles Dodgers are lighting the world on fire against left-handed pitching. In the last two weeks, in terms of team OPS against left-handed pitching, the Los Angeles Dodgers, 29th in baseball, 28th in isolated power. So this team is definitely, you know, not producing at the highest of levels against uh, left-handed pitching. It's not the biggest sample size for the Los Angeles Dodgers. But the numbers are what they are. The Colorado Rockies, well, I think they'll be able to at least put some runs on the board. They have been able to be competitive in some spots. And I just think that that, the value is going to be on the Rockies plus the run and a half here. I wouldn't be surprised if they want it outright. The the Dodgers, as good as they are, are not going to win every single game. And we've seen that with this little semi-cold stretch they've been on over the last couple of weeks. But I'll take a shot with the Rockies here plus the run and a half. And that's going to be my free pick. But just a reminder, if you haven't already, make sure you're subscribed to our channel. Smash that thumbs up. It helps us out a ton. And if you're looking for my best bets, you can find those at Pick Dogs Premium. While you're at Pick Dogs, check out our betting tools. They're 100% free. They're the best betting tools in the business and tools that you want to make sure that you have in your back pocket when you're making your best bets for the day's action. And while you're at our YouTube channel, make sure you have notifications turned on so you can be the first to be in the know when the newest content drops here at Pick Dogs. Thanks for watching. See you guys soon.